Hi guys, welcome back. I hope all is well. I hope everyone's having a great day. Yeah, today I have another haul for you, but most of these things were on clearance at Hobby Lobby, so I had to purchase them. I went to Hobby Lobby in two trips because the first time I only bought one item and I'm like, okay, why didn't I buy all of those? I should have bought every one of them. So I went back a few days later and I got the rest of them. But first, we're gonna start off with the Dollar Tree because I do have some Dollar Tree things as well as three things from Walmart. So actually, let's start off with the three things from Walmart. I have three different colors of ribbon, yellow, orange, and green. It is the very thin ribbon. And just to let you know, this one is like a ribbed and this one is like a, um, a smooth. These were 47 or 49 cent and this one was 99 cent. So I picked up this one by mistake because of course I wanted all of the 40, the 40 cent um, ribbon, but I needed the yellow. So 99 cent was okay. All right. So now let's go to the Dollar Tree because that's the only thing I bought from Walmart. I bought these little things and I'm gonna move you up some. These little things are, my dog is in the background, y'all barking. The little uh, lifters, I call them. I'm gonna use these for my washi tape because I have just ran out of space. So I need to make things like two tier or whatever, just to make some space until I purchased the last bookshelf that I could possibly fit in the room. So I bought three of those to kind of com confine my washi tape and have some more space for ribbon and stuff like that. All right, next thing I bought from Hobby Lobby is these beautiful trays. They are so cute. They are pink. They are really big. And I'm gonna use this to, these two to store all my ribbon in. So that's why I bought these two. And they're pink, so they match the theme of my craft room. I also purchased these two packs of paper. As you can see, it is glitter. You get five pieces, it's 12 by 12. So I don't know what other colors came here, but that aqua, which Dollar twenty-five. That was worth it anyway. Because if I went to Hobby Lobby, it would have been more than a dollar twenty-five if it wasn't on sale for that week. So I was like, okay, let me buy that. I don't know what other colors it has, and it's some nice paper. It kind of feels like sticker. Is it sticker? I don't think it's sticker. No, it's not sticker, but it kind of feels like it. Really nice paper, really large. We have a beautiful, beautiful pink. I'm so happy I did purchase this. This green, I love it. Oh my goodness, look at that iridescent. Okay, I need to go back and buy, look at that. I don't know if you can see that with all the lights, y'all, but that is really, really pretty. And there's another one in here. <clears throat> you have like a black. So you got five pieces of this glitter paper for a dollar and a quarter. It was very much worth it. So I will go back and get a few more packs of these because that was definitely worth it, definitely. And I also bought this one and this one tells you what color's in it. This one is still the four by four, but you only get four pieces. And I think this, the white in here is like flat. It's not like the iridescent. We're gonna see. Yeah, it's just the regular white, which is cool. It is very glittery. And you get no glitter on your hands, which is cool. We have this beautiful silver. We have a gold. And we have another black, which is cool. We have two black. So yeah, if you see these paper packs, definitely pick these up at Hobby Lobby. They are well worth it. All right, we're gonna continue with, um, I'm sorry, from Dollar Tree, it's well worth it. We're gonna continue with the Dollar Tree because I still have a few more things. 
I showed you this on the last little haul video. I had the small haul a couple days ago. It was the um, storage for my letters and my numbers. Um, this is for the alphabets. I have one for the numbers, so I purchased purchase this one it's heart cover this one has the heart theme i don't know what theme was the other one was but this one is for the alphabet i told you i have to get that one but this one only, was only available at the store that's really close to my house which they have all the good stuff there but it's just so jumped out i bought these and they are very pretty you get your sparkle and this is, y'all, everything here is journaling. This is no, no coloring. I will make sure I put that in the title of the video. Because I get some coloring people get mad telling me this is a coloring channel. And yeah. This, so stinking cute. Can't wait to use those. I love those, I had to have those. And then we have a stamp. It's alphabet and number stamp. So pretty cool. This was actually where it wasn't supposed to be. So, cause I was actually, I actually been looking for that. And it was totally, it was by the school supplies, not by the crafts. But like I say, that store is so jumped out, but they have the best stuff there. And I bought this calendar to go on my desk because um, I needed, I had a larger one, but I needed something smaller because my desk had that hutch and this is a perfect size. So I bought this calendar. And I'm, I'm going to get into 3D journaling. I'm going to try it just to see if I like it. I may not like it. It may be too much glue and you're going to see what I mean in just a minute. But I bought these little things. Again, we have the iridescent, the gold, and the silver. And they have other variations at, hot, at Dollar Tree. I didn't get them. I got these spray bottles that I'll be using for a paint project that I'm gonna try. I will be using these in the 3D journal, these little glass bottle charms. I'm gonna fill them with things and yeah, they're going to be in my journal. Last but not least, at the dollar store, I purchased three more things. These beautiful iridescent gems that I'll be using. And I bought these. I'm like, why did, I know you see the thumbnail. Like, why did Monet buy flowers? Because I'm going to cut these into smaller pieces and I will be using these in my 3D journal. I'm j I will just be using the little beady part. So it's just something I wanna try. It may or may not work, <laughs> but I'm gonna try it. All right, y'all, so that was everything from the Dollar Tree. Now I'm going to the Hobby Lobby clearance sale. The first few items I'm gonna show you are, were not on clearance. So it's it was only, uh, I think these first few items that were not on clearance. These little fairy tale books, Alice in Wonderland. Gonna use those in my Alice in Wonderland journal. These little mini holy Bibles. I was not leaving Hobby Lobby without these because I wanna do um, a spiritual spread from my journal. And these little Bibles were just perfect. Okay, the last thing that wasn't on clearance was this paper. Y'all know it's Valentine's month. So I bought this. And these were 59 cents each. Yeah, these were 59 cents each. We bought that one. And they were not on sale this week. So I only bought a few. Hopefully next week they will go on sale and I'll buy all of the rest of them as well as all of the St. Patrick's and all the other paper that I want. Cause I found, I used to buy the paper packs from Amazon for around $6, some more, some less. 
But I figured out if I go to Hobby Lobby, when the paper is 40% off, I get a better deal because I get to pick exactly what I want. I'm not gonna get something in this paper pack that I don't like and I'm never gonna use. So, yeah. I also chose this love as well as this black and white heart. So, sorry about that. That's the paper I purchased. Everything else was on sale. I showed you the larger hearts that I had purchased from the Dollar Tree, but this is the small ones, the mini ones that I purchased from Hobby Lobby. And they were 40% uh, off or 50% off, one of them. Because all the Valentines is 40 or 50% off, which I plan to go back. <laughs> I've used my budget, my crafting supply budget, coloring budget, it's all one. I've used my budget for uh, the first part of the month, the second part of the month, I will have a different, another budget. That's how I do it. And I've used all of my budget for the first half of the month. So second half of the month, I will be able to go to Hobby Lobby and get all that pink stuff to decorate my room. All right, now we're going to get to oh, one more, two more things that wasn't on clearance. This moth. How pretty and that one had the pink. There's all different kinds of moss and greenery. It has the purple. It's a moss mix. I think it was around $10.99. Yeah, it was $10.99. It was a night on sale, but I wanted this to do journaling for my journal, my 3D journaling. And I also purchased these little cute heart button hearts that I'll be using for February Valentine's for that spring. I thought they were so cute. But these were 99 cents, I think. Yeah, 99 cents. All right, let's get to the clearance stuff. This was in the sewing section all of the sewing stuff is on clearance like all that cute cute stuff that sewology stuff it's all on clearance i got this for 94 cent and it's really 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 heavy and i'm like that would be great for like tearing washi and that would just be great to have on my desk and it's so damn cute i had to have it really cute really happy i bought that one but all that sew stuff, even the sewing bags, the kits, everything is on clearance. They have some really, really cute stuff. I hope they still have some stuff the second half of the month because I would definitely go back and buy more stuff. All right, washi tape. The Sewology area had this washi tape. This kind of looks like a bee theme. Just really cute and it's on this little wooden thing. Let me open it so you can see it. See, this is a little wooden thing that the washi tape is on. That is so stinking cute. I just thought it was super cute. And it was $1.49 and I was like, yeah, I'm buying that. Definitely buying that one. And it was washi tape, so y'all knew I was gonna buy it anyway, right? Y'all know me all too well. I'm trying to open this without breaking a nail, y'all. Sorry about the noise, but yeah. And I'm quite sure this just, yeah. You just turn it to get it off. And you can put add more. But look at that cute washi. So stinking cute. These were so cute. I had to have them. $1.49. And that's over by this. Go to the sewing area. Well, just go everywhere. They don't just have, like, really everything I purchased was not in the clearance section. It was just in the regular section where all the rest of the stuff like that is. And... 
I was just so surprised because it, usually my walk, my uh, Hobby Lobby puts stuff in the clearance section. Okay, I have all of these. I have some paper clips so they won't roll. This is the tool, it's the short tool. This is the glitter, this is gold, and it was $1.49. And that's how much you get in the measurements. And there's also more of these that I didn't buy that I will go back and get. We have the pink, silver, and we also have the black. Y'all, they had all the colors. I'm going back and get them. <laughs> I just hope they're there the second half of the month. And then I have these flat colors that were on clearance. These were 99 cent. This is the measurements. And this beautiful, beautiful blue. I love this color on my nails. And I also got a flat black and a flat pink. So that's all of those. Now let's get into the ribbon. Initially, my first time when I went in, because I saw someone's video. Well, I went to Hobby Lobby first and I bought a few things and then I saw someone's video. I had only purchased these. I had not purchased all the tool and I saw the video and all the tool, she had the pretty, pretty tool. My Hobby Lobby didn't have all that pretty what she had, but I went back and bought the tool and about the rest of the ribbon. Cause I initially only, I had only bought these two, the glitter, of course I was gonna get this one. And of course the gold. And this is the measurements. Eight piece, four yards. And it was only $2.24 for each one of these. That gold is so beautiful. I love it, glad I got two. But this is the multi-glitter and the gold. When I went back, I also purchased the silver and it's also a lot of iridescent. And I also purchased the black and white. We got lots of glitter ribbon now, and I love that. That's really cute. The black, and then I also purchased the red, which I could use a lot of this for Valentine's. And all, like I say, all of these were uh, 224, which was a steal. I wish they would have had more colors, but this is what they had, and I bought every one of them, which, I was happy I did. I bought it in two trips, but hey. Last but not least, I purchased the Aileen's Clear Gel Tacky Glue. And it's an all purpose. It dries clear, which is what I needed. This was only like $2.30 um, on Amazon. The original one I had put in my cart was almost $6. And then I just keep look, I kept looking because if you go and you keep looking on Amazon, once you find the item you want, go through that area and you may find a cheaper price on the same product. And I did just that. So I bought this and this is for my 3D journaling that I'm going to attempt. But I will put the glue below. Everything else I purchased not at Amazon. So it comes from Hobby Lobby, the Dollar Tree and Walmart. If you have any questions, feel free to um, contact me, comment below, whatever you want to do. Y'all, thank you for watching. Have a great day.